today it is monday february 6 2017 and i just finished my super long day mondays are usually really long from 8 a.m to 5 p.m or even later and today as you guys saw we did partner impressions and it is actually harder than you think yeah it's totally different from when you're trying to do it on a model rather than a real life person but it was a really good experience i'm not done with everything but um i'll be sure to finish up because i don't want to get too behind anyways today was a really strange day it just lots of like unfortunate things happened and it kind of like bummed me out but i'm trying to remain more positive and just keep pushing forward and moving forward rather than just dwelling in the past <laughs> So I finished class today. It was fairly early. Um, today I got to, we had anatomy lab. And in this anatomy lab, we had to do the temporal and the infratemporal region. And I got to cut with a bone vibrator saw thing. Um, I got to cut the ramus or what was it like the mandible part it was pretty cool um my friend norik did most of the other stuff but i got to participate in one of the bone cutting so that was pretty awesome So it is about 11.30 p.m. and right now I am just trying to finish up studying or preparing for my anatomy lab class. Usually what I do before every anatomy lab is I would go through the checklist that um, the professor provides and I would write my notes and also um, draw pictures if necessary. So what we're doing tomorrow is the oral region and I got some like muscles. I drew a diagram of the muscles, um, and then the nerves, that, the important nerves, and then like all these notes too, and it really helps and saves time. In the beginning of every anatomy lab class, the teacher or the professor will give us a demo on what they want us to pay special attention to, and they will point it out on a cadaver. I really highly suggest you guys, if you're taking an anatomy lab to bring your own notes beforehand and that way you kind of have a more of a journal idea where everything is. 